Keith Ranieri, former leader of the Clifton Park-based Nexium cult, continuing to fight his conviction from prison as he and his new lawyer want a new trial. Ranieri was convicted back in 2020 on multiple charges connected to his time as leader of Nexium, where he sexually assaulted and blackmailed multiple women. An appeals court upheld his 120-year conviction last month. In a court appearance yesterday, Ranieri's attorney, Joseph Tully, asked the judge to be disqualified before the motion for a new trial is dealt with due to alleged bias. Tully also asking for a new trial, alleging the FBI tampered with evidence leading to his conviction. Federal prosecutors have denied Ranieri's claims of government tampering with evidence. Whether he's a, a good guy or a bad guy, a nice person or the, a, 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 the devil, um, it, everybody deserves a fair trial. Um, it'll be a, a completely different set of issues. Um, the new trial will be focused solely on the tampering, where the, the appeal uh, was not. Ranieri is not the only Nexium player who has been fighting from prison. Last month, the court also upheld the sentence handed down to Claire Bronfman, the Seagram's heiress who sat on Nexium's executive board.